For starters, talk a little about the way you were used in high school. Obviously, you had the ball in your hands a lot because you mm -hmm. scored an awful lot of points. Mm -hmm. But how much time did you spend working as a true point guard on your high school team? Um, I played point pretty much every game. Uh, I started when I was like a sophomore. And ever since then, I pretty much played the point guard position. So. What are the biggest adjustments when you go back and forth from one guard to the other? What are the, the toughest adjustments that you have to make on either end of the floor? Um, defensively, I would say some point guards are just a lot quicker. And then some of the shooting guards are just a lot more long and uh, stuff like that. And this is something you have to make an adjustment during the game. All right. And so you're both. You're quick. you got long arms. you got some height. Which do you prefer matching up against? Um, I'll probably say... Somebody who's built similar like me, somebody who's probably long, and because uh, I, I know what they're I know what they're saying, I know what they go through. Because I'm I'm like myself, I'm long, so uh, you know that's a little bit easier for me. Your first game the other night, 17 points. You go seven for nine. Any nerves at all? The stat sheet certainly doesn't suggest it. I'm nervous before the game, but you know when the ball tips and you see your teammates out there having fun and stuff, it makes it a lot easier to enjoy yourself. Any different from? Your first game in high school, your first AAU game? Uh, not really. I'm pretty much nervous before. I'm pretty much nervous before every game, but once once the ball tips, you know, all nerves are gone. And it's time to play. All right. So how do you how do you control that? How, why does it go away once the ball goes up? Um, I would think just because you're comfortable. You know, you just when you when you get down to it, you're just playing basketball, and that's something you've been doing your whole life. So you know, you can't make it more than what it is. Most of your shots, most of your points came in the second half the other night. Was that simply a matter of getting that first half under your belt, or did the coaches say they wanted you to look more aggressively to the rim in the second half? What was different? Um, I think it was just my teammates. My teammates did a really good job of uh, looking for me and encouraging me to shoot the ball whenever I caught it, and it just translated, and I was able to score some. How much do you... How much time do you spend with the other guards on the team, whether it's Nick or Keith or Sterling, picking their brains and getting advice on how to Look at this, uh, how to address different situations. Um, pretty much every day, you know, every day I come up to to Nick or to uh, SB or to Keith and just try to talk to them about something new or seeing what they see. And especially Nick, he helps me a lot whenever I have to play the point position. I'm able to just come to him in games, even and just be like, uh, just ask him what he sees and what I, what I should do. So. Your first game, you had a nice stat line. You blew the other guys out of the gym, but obviously there's always things to improve. What do you want to fix between or work on between now and Sunday? Um, I would think specifically just defensive breakdowns and uh, making sure we get every single rebound before we take off into fast breaks. And um, I think if we just work on those things, we'll be fine.